Did you ever uh, confide in your brothers? You know, because when I was in the band, I used to confide in them a lot. You know, right. Spanned out. Uh, yes, yes, I have. As a matter of fact... Um... Because they be my band became like my brothers in the same way as... Right, yes. Yeah, same yeah, thing my, uh, my band was my brothers. Yeah, of course. So that can be good and that can be bad. Because uh, I... Yeah. matter of fact, when I came here, uh, real quick, they told me, you know, okay, come do loose with me. I'm all excited. Then they tell me I have three other guys with me. And I said, okay. wait a minute. I thought I was gonna have a harem, you know, I was gonna sit back and all, <laughs> and all the ladies around me, but but you guys are great. No, in America, you know, we, we you know, we go to therapy uh, when you need. I've been to therapy with my family, uh, my, my siblings, by myself, and it actually, it, you know, it, it helps. So it's because, normal? Well, not, no, well, if you wanna get things off your chest and you wanna just open up and, because I'm yeah. one that stayed to myself and I need to let some of this yeah. stuff out. Did out. you have group therapy after Michael's death? Uh, what, well, actually, what happened, uh, one of the things that we did was um, I went to go see my brother, mm. <clears throat> and uh, uh, he said, Marlon, can you believe what they're doing, trying to do to me? I said, Mar I said Michael, don't even worry about it. The Lord has already had it taken care of. And he was a little upset. He went for a walk, and I wrote down these affirmations that I used myself, and I left them on his bed because I had, I had to run. But I already knew that everything was going to be okay, which it happened to be, happened to be okay. But, yes, it, it brings... Well, the passing of a brother, of course, yeah. with any family, is going to bring you together. You know what? I think it's a generational thing as well. I think we're a lot more open nowadays. Mm. You know, where, where my mum and dad were even embarrassed to s let me see them holding hands when yeah. I was a kid. I, I remember re clearly them taking their hands away. It's my dad, like, it's, it's that generational thing where I know he loves me. Like, I know he loves, I know he loves me because when I leave in the car, he'll tap the roof twice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's my dad loving me, you know? <laughs>